How's it going, Pokemon trainers? I'm Trainer Connor, and yes, we are here with Battle Spot videos today. I'm going to share two battles where we can try out Mega Alakazam, because Mega Alakazam... I, I got a new Alakazam from a friend that has... Uh, it's a shiny color. So that's cool. And then you have a uh, knockoff as an interesting move. I wanted to see how it well how it fares well in battle, excuse me. But yeah, uh, I am out of town as I'm posting this video. Be on the lookout for another battle spot video tomorrow where I get to try out Mega Mewtwo X. So that's a thing. We're gonna try out different things. That's what we're here for. As you all know, if you like this video, make sure you like this video and subscribe. Okay, so our first opponent here, who is actually named Celebi after the Pokemon Celebi, he's gonna start out with his own Celebi there. And I'm gonna go to U-turn, go into Alakazam. I could have gone with a Brave Bird, but that's pretty darn obvious. Now, unfortunately, he has a Thunder Wave, which meters Alakazam's speed. But, fortunately though, we have the ability Trace, and what's awesome about this ability is that you get to trace Celebi's natural cure ability, and I will be able to get rid of the paralysis when I switch out, so. Here we get to try out knockoff, and unfortunately we don't knock out an item off. That is such a weird sentence. I don't know why I said that. But anyway, so we don't have any uh, shenanigans with knockoff. You guys don't have an item that we can knock off. That's a little unfortunate, but that's okay. We can go ahead, go back in the count frame, and we will revenge kill with a brave bird. And uh, I'm not going to use just count frame. It's going to be nice insurance in the back there. Um... So after we take out Caesar, I will switch out because obviously a Fire Blitz will knock out Caesar. Uh, if he had a Focus Sash, because I see Focus Sash a lot on Caesar via Battle Spot, you would think that he would have that, but no, he does not have it. So we take out Mega Caesar, or just regular Caesar, excuse me. So, yes, we're going to spread the love around. We'll go ahead and try out Tyrantrum now. And uh, he went for Sucker Punch, which is a little bit weird considering I could go to the Brave Bird, which has higher priority because of uh, Gale Wings. So, here he gets to continue going for Sucker Punch. He gets two critical hits in a row, which, that is a red flag that that Absol is super luck, which increases the number of critical hits you get in battle, so. And we confirm this because of super luck being traced by Mega Alakazam. I wanted to make it interesting. I thought he would think that I would have Calm Mind and I would stall out his Sucker Punch, but that is neither here nor there. He gets to go with another Sucker Punch, takes out Mega Alakazam. That is unfortunate, but I wanted to make it interesting because I, either way, I had Gale Wings in the back uh, to bypass any other priority that the Absol may have. So we get to take out Celebi there, the opponent. Now here's the second match. I am using uh, Greninja and Alakazam in this battle, as well as my Tyrantrum to start out. Um, we see that my opponent has a uh, Primal Groudon, which I, you know what guys, in Battle Spot, you get to bring whatever you want. I'm actually in the, uh, the type of battle format where you get to bring whatever the heck you feel like. So we're going to see a lot of, like, legendaries. I don't have anything for Primal Groudon. Let's just say that. Now, unfortunately, uh, yeah, I am Scarf, so we get to outspeed uh, Blastoise. We almost take him out with a Dragon Claw, but he has Blizzard, 
kind of like, you know, hey, I have this, I fooled you kind of moment there. And it's like, no, so we lose uh, Tyrantrum, but it's okay, we can go back into Greninja, or actually we go into Greninja, and we finish him off with a Dark Pulse. Now here is the scary moment of the battle where we get to use uh, or we get to see Primal Groudon in action, so that's cool. Uh, the best option that I have against Primal Groudon is to freeze it. Uh, yeah. Any kind of water type move I go for is going to get evaporated by the harsh sunlight. And yeah, so. We go the light speed, but we don't get what we wanted, a freeze, and we get knocked out by an earthquake. The last Pokemon is Mega Alakazam, and I need to take him out with a side shock. That's the only attacking move that is a stab, same type of attack bonus there. Uh, we need to take him out with a side shock because if we can't, then this battle is over. So we come out real short there. We were close, but not quite. And a single overheat is going to finish me off. Boosted by the sun, there's no way we're going to live it. So that is it. Uh, the first set of battles there for the weekend. Mega Alakazam kind of came in the clutch there. Knock off didn't really do as much as I wanted because, you know, what I mean by that is we don't knock out any items off. That's, that's the whole idea there. But we don't get a chance to do that. But we get to use, like, Greninja and uh, all those Pokemon. So, all right, that's it for now, guys. If you enjoyed this uh, video, make sure you like this video. Comment down below of what you enjoyed about this video if you want to. And be on the lookout for Mega Mewtwo X in the next battle video. All right, have a great weekend, trainers. I'll see you then. Later.